Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the concert. We try to perform music from Roman times on instruments from that area. If you were at the lecture, you already know the pieces, and now you can follow. Okay, the best would be just to open it here. <laughs> so I thought about just to have here the music scores and to perform here at the side of the stage. So this is Cycle Song. I already sang it an hour before, you know the story and what is missing is the English translation of the text. I got it here. The text means as long as you live, shine, have no grief at all. Life exists only for a short while, and time will demand its toll. So this is the text of the Seculus song, and I will perform it with a little syrinx. The same instrument we use today was in use in Roman times. Ha son ses painu, meren holos ulupu, pros oligon estiton sen, totelos ha kranos apaiti. Ha son ses painu, meren holos ulupu, Ross only gone as Teton Zen, Totelos Hotelos Apaiti. Hosson says, Pai nu, Meren Holos Ulupu, Ross only gone as Teton Zen, Totelos Hokronos Apaiti. Now, this is the song, the famous song of Sikilos, written on this stone. The next piece is here, the so-called Michigan Papyrus. We already discussed the problem that almost nothing is left. We have to reconstruct it and we have 14 different notes on this Papyrus. And we try now to form it with, by the organ. The problem is there are only 13 keys, the 14 notes. So we try to get the missing note by the registers. You just step from one register to the other. I have no idea if it works. We try it.
short instrumental piece from the Michigan Papyrus and yeah, you notice that this melody is somehow stranger than the famous Siculus song from the beginning. This is music composed by Mesomedes of Creta, 2nd century AD. And Mesomedes was a favorite composer of Emperor Adrian. He was a so called Kitarrüde. That means he played the guitar. <laughs> And we know four invocations and hymns which he composed about several subjects. This here is an invocation to the muses. The music you can see here or singing and I think when he performed his own music of course he was accompanied accompanying his, his singing with the guitar so I try <laughs> Instrumental music again. So this music, I think, was written for player of the aulos. Beginner in aulos playing. There are several melodies written down at the score. And we will perform it Aulos and with the kitara. Let's say we begin here and then we take this one and then here anywhere. I will choose it.
you can also perform this music, instrumental music, for example, on the, the organ. So, let's try to play some melodies from this script on the organ. You can see four different, four and a half different pieces from here to here, it is Payan to Apollo. And of course, you have to use the kitara to praise Apollo. The problem is the right part of the score is missing. So, I did a reconstruction of this part, and I think it's important to know where the original notes end and the, reconstructions, the reconstruction begins. So, I decided to hum the missing part. That means, if you hear the notes are reconstructed. And if you hear Greek text, you know this is original music. Okay. Peter's 
Hai di naik santu Hakai di semenu Hayan hasu Thai sungkanas Hym nonek sarkis Xas ponar Os pyr Kaitai stepsas Latus Matos laban Kedo Zeus Dadukis Todas En Dolois Short instrumental He's played on the guitar. <laughs> played on the organ so also here about 40% are missing and here we construct <laughs> Tragedy of Ajax, theater music, and so we try to perform it like it was in the, we think it was in theater in Greek and Roman times. We need an aulos, because there was always an aulos in the theater, and the chitarra, and of course, we have here. Big Messer, Mask. Is anybody here who wants to perform me? Big Messer, Supernova. You are a Big Messer. So, the sorrow of Big Messer about the death of Ives.
Sang Tella Monia Da Tosson Aya Dio Du Se Aton Alitron Ho Hel Kessin Hopatu You can see here this papyrus with the last part of a Christian song. Actually, it's the oldest Christian song we know. It is a hymn Trinitatis, written down in this notation we know now from all the other music scores and we had some hymn to Apollo and to the muses and so on so I would like it to just to finish the concert with a Christian song. The wonderful text tells us that the water in the river is quiet the stars stop shining and all the world is praising the Lord. So this is the text. And if you see the tradition of Christian music, you understand immediately that they were not interested in instruments in the beginning. They just were singing the music without guitar, without organ, of course, the instrument of the gladiators, and without the outlaws from the theater. Just seeing like it is nowadays in the Orthodox Church still. And following the tradition of Orthodox Church, we just have here a little bell to mark the moment when the Trinity is named in this text. So, listen to this very early Christian music.
was the concert I hope you had a little impression of the remains of Greek and Roman music. To make it short, it's just, of course, we have an encore. And I think it would be a nice idea to form the encore together. <laughs> so we try just to perform a particular song from the beginning with all of us. So, just sing this note. <laughs> Wonderful. And when I do like this, you mean. <laughs> Great. And so, we try it. So the accompaniment by the audience, the text, I have it all, so. Our song says, Pai nu, meden halos ulupu, pros oligon estiton zen, tartelos hakranos apaiti, Hazon says, Pai nu, meden halos ulupu, pros oligon estiton zen, Tortellos hakranos apaiti, hazon ses painu, meden holos ulupu, prothaligon estiton zen, tortellos hakranos apaiti. Thanks a lot. <laughs> Come here and just ask. Thanks. <laughs>